All right, so here's a quick update. Um, got a lot of the core mechanics in place, but uh, I'm not out of the woods yet. I still got quite a bit of work to do. So here we go. Um, so we have save slots now. This does all work with the controller as well. So I can choose a character, choose the level, go normal. I go ahead and play with the controller. Sounds need to be updated. I just recorded some silly sounds just to have something in place. Boing. Boing. As you can see, um, starts out faded as you gain more and more of the knowledge crystals. The screen becomes colorized. And once you collect all of them, the level will be completely in color. Click. Boing. Still have a problem with the gravel texture, apparently. It's something I just noticed. Poison's working. Got a little bit of work to do on the debuffs. They like to reset themselves sometimes, which is a bad thing. So, working on that. It's mainly when you get another debuff on top of that one for some reason it's resetting it. Little hidden areas occasionally. Transitions need a little bit of work. You know, I told you, got some stuff to do, but uh, you can use camera control and of course go into settings and you can actually unlock the camera completely but generally I like to keep it locked because uh, if children play it they like to put the camera up first its butt and they don't know how to uh, undo that so double jump now Probably should get an icon for the uh, either a chest or um, a model for the boots instead of the orb. I'm not a graphics guru, so it's going to take a little bit of time to get some of this stuff worked out. But good progress. I mean, we're, we're making it there. Those, <laughs> those footsteps look like poop now. That's great. Get a little bit more color. Um, oh, retractable traps. They hurt. They bleed you. Slow bleed. Probably don't want to stand there. It's a little discrepancy in my steps there that I wouldn't have seen in color. Just little wedges down there. Click. Easily fixed. Especially when you're timed. Um, this area is not really even done. Just the exit. And you got a result screen. And we got all the fragments. So, And we completed it. So now we can do hard mode. Oh, there's a bug. It's supposed to be in color. But, eh. It's okay. That's what I got so far. Got work to do. Um, 
just noticed a couple of things, so. And the idea is, generally, you can rerun it in um, hard mode, and there is uh, very little time. You see, I've only got a minute and 36 seconds. Obviously, this is where the uh, those rings come in really handy because they increase your time. So... won't be any more uh, gems because I realistically um, once you collect all the shards it's supposed to be in color and difficult or hard mode has uh, more traps more difficult jumps uh, traps do more damage hidden things show up um, some of the safety nets that were there before are gone. So, not really that kid friendly on the hard mode, but uh, you can actually jump off ledges now, or you couldn't before. Believe me, this is just a test level, so it's not that hard, but it's going to be getting a lot harder. Um, on the actual levels, hard mode will be uh, considerably harder. The only difficulty on hard mode right now with the levels is the time. Time constraint really gets you. I don't honestly know if I'll even make it. And those are electric. So it does a little zzz and get you. In hard mode, you do not have time, or in, yeah, hard mode, you do not have time to go back and get things. Yeah. <laughs> I was screwing around at the beginning and lost about 20 seconds talking and screwing around, so that's what killed my time. Oh, there's a bug. It reset my time. Isn't that nice? So yeah, it's not supposed to reset your time, it's supposed to go back to the time that you have Boing. when you hit that checkpoint, so that's interesting. If I stand up, it takes a little hit, yep, that's there, that hurts, platforms are smaller, I'm debating on making the platforms move faster, but that kind of throws the timing off on certain things, so I might not do that. And on hard mode, getting all of the uh, gems is crucial and avoiding any haste traps. Or not gems, uh, rings, ring things. So yeah, just running through this, showing you guys, I discovered some new bugs. Um, and now we got three stars for hard mode. Um, that's it. That's really all I've got right now. You guys take care.